Hi everybody, it's Urban Sweetheart Teresa. I'm coming back to you with a new wig for you, making sure my camera's on. All right, first of all, somebody uh, asked me a question yesterday. This is me, no makeup. I just put on some moisturizer. It's a, like a, a illuminating moisturizer with a couple drops of oil and some sunscreen. That mask, that mask. I don't know if it's like making it like a hot house <laughs> and them hairs is just like popping up everywhere. But yeah, my skin has been going through it since this thing was mandatory. You have to wear a mask. It's really like right where that mask are. Boom. Boom. Right where that end piece. I don't understand it. Right under the chin because a lot of times I'm pulling it down. Uh, so yeah. Mm. <laughs> not very happy right now what I think I might do and I'm still using my Mishi I really am It's maybe it's keeping it from getting worse but it's like it's, uh, I might maybe tw in the fall give the uh, professional hair removal at a doctor's office another try because this right here is really especially right here this irritates me so bad. I need to get something done. All right, enough said with that. Here we go. This is the wig we're doing today. Can't get it right, Teresa. This is the uh, Sensational Cloud Nine Swiss Lace. What lace hairline? Illusion Lace Wig. And this is Rena. Rena? Rena? Yeah, I think it's Rena. And a 1B. I went for a basic color. I'm tired of them burgundies. And I didn't, you know, them blondes was looking like, mm -mm, nah, I don't think so. So let's take this out the box. Put the car up back away from me up close. And I'm trying to see what it says. It says natural density. So I'm assuming that means pre plucked hairline well no it didn't say that Teresa it said natural density um showing that around the on the stock card around the hairline says natural density so and it says undetectable that's the detectable harsh hairline this is the undetectable <laughs> yeah we shall see all right, got that lighter color lace. You know, you have to go in with something to darken it up for brown toned skin. We got the cones on the side. Don't feel no bendable ear tabs. I was looking for a comb at the top, but nope. Comb in the back, adjustable straps. What it's looking like inside. All right, let's look at this hairline. See some baby hairs. Oh, we got plenty of stuff. Remember that baby hair experience I had not so long ago. I'm tempted just to go start cutting these junks off right now. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try it on with the lace still attached. See where I was looking. See if I could work with these baby hairs. Hairs. Oh Lord. <laughs> oh Let's go with the next one. Yeah, they're going all the way down around the whole front. The cap is coming down ear to ear. It feels comfortable, but like it's you know, it's there. It's like if you got a bigger head. Yeah, I got some stretch in the back. Guess you could get big braids or whatever under there. 
Ooh, it's a lot of hair. It's a lot of hair. It's a lot of hair. <laughs> a lot of hair. But you got a fear of a lot, <laughs> lot of hair. <laughs> oh, you might not want to get this unit, but if you like it long and it's going to get big, then this is the right unit. Look at that line. Looking quite good. It's decent with these baby hairs. All right, so I'm gonna go cut the lace and I'll be right back. Okay, everybody. So I went and I was about to show you how to card again, but I forgot it. I'm gonna put it together. It's just going to a mess. So I put some uh, foundation and a little bit of powder in the part because the straps closer together. See how this bad boy looks. These baby hairs. I didn't cut none of them off. Almost fell out of the tree. I hate these baby hairs. I really do. Please don't let me spray myself in that. Oh, that's again. Let's get a wet up there. I've got blow dry next to me. I'm not sure it's going to lace where it was under. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to use my baby hairs. Maybe I'm just going to put a little bit of this spray in the hair and just blend it. And the lace is already messed up. What I'm going to do? Oh, give me a little comb over method. I'm going to let this tack down a little bit before I start messing with it. I think somebody was asking me that before um, about this. Uh, when I put this on, I normally have it on all day. Just how I did a few spots. I normally have it on all day when I come from work or something. Hey, focus. Oh, uh, um, I'm oily. So when I get here, I just go bloop and the thing comes right off. Now, there has been some times where I just put it on to go out or something. And so when I come back, I go like, this, and then I'm like, oh, it ain't moving. I'll go wet my fingers to start working it around the hairline and um and it start lifting wet it a little bit more and just you know like soaking wet and just go around and it'll lift straight on up now i don't know when it, people be doing that ball cap method and then you like shh, shh, everything all in the hair and stuff mm, nah you're gonna have to saturate that bad boy to get it back off or you're gonna be pulling up some of all your hair that's my opinion. I like my lip color today. I wanted something pink. Anyway, get into this. Hey, my face is steamy. You like my shirt this time? It says vintage 70s. Yes, I was born in 1970. Don't tell nobody. <laughs> 
1970. That was a big year. Truth be told, I was born. That was a big year. Come on, Pastor. Ah, that was Pastor. I might switch this a little bit. I think I'm wearing my coat too tightly. Yeah, I think I might switch to bigger. Something bigger. Better than something. I got my hands close to my hand. I want I I like these right here. They have like the rhinestones and they're not heavy. These are heavy. That's so why they start pulling on my ear. And I can't wear earrings for like two or three days because they're so you could tell. You see how it's pulling my earlobe? Okay, this one doesn't. <sighs> like overcast day or something like this, but I gotta tell myself at least you got your day off. So be happy, be joyous. Okay. So again, y'all have the baby hairs. If you want to start swooping and whatever, whatever, knock yourself out. This is what the hairline is looking like. Cut. I'm going to put a little bit of mousse just to define these guys a little bit, just a little bit. And like I said, I'm going to get these big hairs straight out of my face. Partial to a right sided part. Not going to part it, even though you can. I'm just going to do that little comb over joint. You see, I think I was doing that with the mousse too, because I don't want to comb through it to see, you know, how much loose hair, shed hair, or anything. I don't want it to get big. Not yet. This is some long hair. Can't you believe? Did y'all hear my stomach growling? Time for me to go. I need something to eat. All right. Down the arm, it comes down to my butt. To my butt, did I see that? To my butt, <laughs> to my butt. I know y'all seen that. Lord have mercy. Let me, let me just lose it. I know y'all like, child, you don't be still. I wanted to show y'all the movement. Movement, especially get out in the wind or something. Let's see how this bad boy moves. Y'all see if you didn't want to cut them baby hairs, see how I just blended them in. Without, you know, maybe I want to use them on a later date. So they pretty much out my way now. I'm like, do I want a little spot? So I said, damn, you should have figured that out. Before you put all this mousse and stuff. I don't want a defined part, so I think I'm just going to just comb over. And yeah, I'm trying to make it a little bit bigger. I can see what I'm doing at the roots. I'm glad I knew these um things and the adjustable straps because this month I was saying before you know about you know it's fitting good it's like big and friendly in that back section but I got it it's laying down but I was like man if I would have kept it at the first um for the adjustable straps this thing would be swimming on my head okay 
here's what we're working with today. Like I said, I'm not going to use my baby hairs, but you could if you wanted to. You can add up powder uh, and foundation. Just mix that lace fit the, um, not fit, but the skin tone. I guess I probably could just put a little bit in here. No, I don't got it near me. I'm probably going to go in whatever, however I'm going to lay this down. You know, for the day, I probably just put a little touch of uh, pressed powder in the parting area. See how I'm trying to cover that up? I mean, I don't even want those parts. I really don't. I really don't. Do I like it? Yep. But when I buy this again, back to the nose. Look on this bag going here. No. So how long is that going to last? How long is that going to last? I truly want to believe I want to do something else with this. Maybe off the head. I mean, y'all didn't hear that. Off the head. Off the face. Like, have it going back. Because with the hairline, you could get away with it. I might fish out one or two baby hairs. Streak it. Yeah, I know I like big hair, so it's gonna go there. I can believe it. it's gonna go there. I was just trying not to let it start so soon. You see, I'm already trying to get that height going. Put it on. So, let me see if I want it behind the hair. If it's lightly, then I'm gonna break the cast. I'm just gonna streak a little something there. A little something right here, not that much though. Just, just a little, just a little. And then I'm gonna keep it off my face. But I like it. It's just not gonna last. I'm being realistic. It's not gonna last. It's too much hair. Way too much. Definitely going out partying here. You want to be the one. Imagine if you got this in some color. Woo wee. Ain't no need to tell you nothing. Oh, Lord Jesus. <laughs> yes. Y'all, I love me some hair. This is beyond Shaka Khan. Beyond. I think maybe I could get Diana if I, I'd have to tease it. Make it really big. I don't know who who I'm trying to channel with this. <laughs> this is a little This is a lot of hair. <laughs> so my gosh. I know I seen one girl do it. I'm not sure who it was. Got a few strands. And this is my first initial going through it when I was doing it with the loose and stuff. Let's see all that comes out of here. Did I cut it close? Mm -hmm. I got it did as I could. I didn't see no hair because I didn't cut the baby hairs off. These are long hairs. Y'all see that? Little nest. Ugh. And I got to figure out what I'm going to do. What I'm going to do. I had a comb up there. I almost want to comb through it. And I know that ain't like me. I feel like I need to get the height back here. The 80s coming out in <laughs> the 80s, big hair. The 80s. All right, so this is it for me. Like I said, I'm probably going to 
do a little couple of baby hairs just because I got to cut it. That's why I'm not doing it right now. This got to be cut. And then I'll swoop it. You know, because I'll swoop one, the two pieces right here. Then after it dries, I'll break the cast. So it'll be like a natural swoop. But I ain't got that much time, so let me hurry up. I told you I was hungry. Got to get going. Raina, this is uh, Sensational Cloud 9 Swiss Lace uh, Unit. What lace in the color? 1D. Thank you as always for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. I appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, and hit that notification bell.